take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Fatigue. Slight fatigue is normal after a blood donation, and some people experience this more than others. Anyone who feels tired after donating blood should rest until they feel better. Drinking plenty of water and restoring vitamin and mineral levels may help reduce fatigue. Let's help you make your mark. Fatigue and lightheadedness. People may feel fatigued or experience some dizziness, lightheadedness, or nausea after donating blood. This is because of the temporary lowering of blood pressure. If a person feels faint, they can sit down and put their head between the knees so that it is lower than the heart. Take our lead. So, to answer the question that we posed in the beginning, yes, you can drive if you have donated blood, but you will have to wait for a bit. This is because you will probably feel a little bit dizzy, and it would not be a good idea for you to be behind the wheel right away. Let's help you make your mark. Anyone can donate plasma, but most people make better whole blood donors. The vast majority of people are either O positive or A positive, so most other people can receive their red cells in a transfusion. Only those with AB positive blood could receive them. Let's help you make your mark. After a donation, most people's hemoglobin levels are back to normal after 6 to 12 weeks. This is why we ask donors to wait for a minimum of 12 weeks between donations, 12 weeks for men and 16 weeks for women, to ensure that we don't risk lowering your hemoglobin levels over the long term. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.